Hi everyone, it's Imrel. Welcome to my channel. Like, comment, subscribe below. Awesome. So today I went to Walgreens and I went to Dollar Tree and I was looking for Dollar Tree. I was looking for like wrapping paper and things like that and I got a whole bunch of great stuff. And at Walgreens, I got some great stuff for my kids' teachers, and it was a great deal. So let me show you what I got from Dollar Tree first. All right. So I got a pretty, whoop, I got a pretty big bag. Got a pretty big bag from Dollar Tree. So I got some wrapping paper. And this actually is like, looks like little peppermints are on it. It looks really cute. And I was a little skeptical about buying paper from Dollar Tree because I bought it before and it wasn't the best quality, but I've heard that they've kind of like stepped it up a little bit. So we'll see. I'll let you guys know about that. And I bought some of this paper as well. And all this is by Hallmark. So I'm hoping that it's good because in Hallmark, they kind of stand behind the name a little bit, right? And these have little snowflakes on them. It's kind of like a hologram. It's really cool. Then I got this as well. And this is another like peppermint candy. Like hologram design. And I really like these designs because I thought they were cute and kind of fun and childish because I have a toddler and he's going to be giving gifts to like people in my family. So I want to make sure that the wrapping paper looks real childish and fun and cute. All right. I got some tissue paper and it's 24 pieces in here. It's red and green. And excuse my nails. I need to get them done, but I just haven't had a chance. So I think I'm going to probably do some press-ons because keep, stay tuned. I have a video on some press-ons I got from Walmart, so stay tuned got some bags some gift bags and this is a reindeer with sparkles real cute I got a two-pack gift bag this is a snowman and this some stockings and they both have sparkles on it and funny thing actually I didn't even buy it we didn't even buy a tree this year because I just wasn't really feeling in the spirit, but now I'm kind of in the spirit, but it's kind of late in the game. So I don't know if I should get a tree or not. I don't know. Did you guys get a tree this year? I just don't know what to do. And here is some name tags. And it's 60, which is good because I don't have 60 people to give gifts to anyway. And this is actually not even, this is not even mine. I'm going to have to try to exchange this out because they actually don't take things back at Dollar Tree. I don't know where this came from. It's a card. It looks like for a teacher. So I don't, I don't know where that came from. I have another reindeer bag. And these were a dollar. They weren't the two for a dollar. I thought they were two for a dollar, but then I quickly realized they weren't. Some gift boxes for clothes and things because it seems like all the stores now they're not giving gift boxes anymore I don't know what it is COVID maybe the company is not making gift boxes they're not sending them gift boxes so have to buy your own gift boxes now and this is a two-pack it's a snowman and a penguin that says ho 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 got another box and this is a snowman and a reindeer and this says Christmas and tis the season to be jolly <clears throat> and I got a couple more bags both snowmen with sparkles they didn't really have any bags without sparkles so I try not to get a lot of sparkly things because it gets all over your clothes. And of course some tape. It's like I always think we have tape in the house but I can never find it. So every time I go to the store 
when I have to buy things like gifts and something for someone, I always pick up tape because I'm like, who's eating the tape? Who's throwing away the tape? I don't know if it's in my son's playroom because everything ends up in there. So, you know, that's the end of my bag. Well, the tape I'll put it back in there, but nothing else. All right, so I went to Walgreens because I was looking at a lot of posts and I was seeing that they were having a lot of half off of like their Christmas and holiday stuff. So I went to Walgreens in my neighborhood and I was able to find some great stuff. I found this little coffee mug, Starbucks, and it comes with a little cookie. And it was like originally like $14, but I got it for $7.98. So I got it for half off. And it doesn't have a little bow and a little tag to tell you what's in it. And I thought that mug is really cool. I wanted to get another one of these, but this was the last one they have. So I think I'm going to give that to my kids, like, head teacher. Because they have, like, a head teacher and they have, like, someone helping. And you know how it goes. And then I bought this as well. It has a little tag. That you can put like to and from on it. And this is a hot chocolate. This was also $14.98. And I got it for $7.98. So that was really cool. And I'm not sure if the teachers drink hot chocolate or coffee or not. But I just thought it was like a nice gesture. Because they deal with a lot. Especially with this COVID and everything else they're dealing with a lot. So I thought it was great to show my appreciation. And I think that if you have children that are going to school or daycare, you should probably get something for them as well. Even if it's something small, it could be like a box of chocolates or a little gift card or even like a card that says thanks. I think it's always good to do. And this is another one. This is a coffee and it says it's a, I think it's pronounced Pike Place. And this has a little red handle on it. This was also the um, $14.98. So I got it for $7.98. And it has like what's in it on the back. And I love these little mugs. I think they're super cute. And they're so durable. And then I got my last mug here somewhere. Uh, oh, here it is. Because I got four mugs. Because my teacher, my son has four teachers, which is the reason why I was looking for something that was like not too expensive. Because if you have to buy four or something, it, it kind of adds up. And this is another hot chocolate. And then you have the little two from tag. And it's just really nice. I think it's great for the holidays. And I love that you really don't have to put a bag if you don't want to. But I actually bought bags for it so the dollar tree bags that i got i'm just gonna go ahead and throw them in here they fit really nicely and i'm gonna put a little tissue paper so that's how i'm gonna be giving it to the teachers and that's all i've gotten for the holiday thus far um at walgreens and Dollar Tree, my Walgreens bag is completely empty. That's all I've gotten so far. If I get any other stuff, I'll let you guys know, but I don't think I'll be getting anything else because with, you know, everything kind of shutting down and you're not really able to travel because of the COVID restrictions, I don't really feel as like holiday spirited as I usually am. But if I do get some stuff, I'll let you know and I'll let you know how that paper goes and if it's any different. And let me know what you've been thinking about it because I know you probably tried it because the dollar paper is hard not to, it's hard to resist because every other paper I've seen is like $8, 10 they even have $20 paper. So I can't do that if you're just going to rip it up. So that's all for my video today. Uh, like, comment, subscribe below. Let me know what other videos you would like. If you have any questions about anything that I got and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.